we're asked to write the equation of the line passing through the point negative three comma five that is parallel to y equals eight minus two x. So because the two lines are parallel, the slopes will be equal. So we're looking for a line that's parallel to y equals eight minus two x and passes through the point negative three comma five. So the first step we want to find the slope of the given line because we know the slope of the parallel line will be the same. Remember when a line is in slope intercept form of the form y equals mx plus b, m is equal to the slope which is the coefficient of x. So notice how here we have y equals eight minus two x where the coefficient of x is equal to negative two and therefore the slope is negative two. But if it's helpful we can change the order of these terms and write the given equation as y equals negative two x plus eight. Either way our goal here is to determine the equation of the line that has a slope of negative two, the same slope of the given line, and it passes through the point negative three comma five. So using slope intercept form, we know our equation must be in the form y equals negative two x plus b, where b is equal to the vertical intercept, which would be the ordered pair zero comma b, which we don't have. But because we know our line passes through this point, this ordered pair must satisfy the equation. So in order to find b, we can substitute negative three for x, five for y, and then solve for b. Performing substitution, we'd have the equation five equals negative two times x, which is negative three, plus b. Simplifying, we have five equals six, plus b. Solving for b, we would subtract six on both sides. Simplifying, we have negative one equals b. And therefore, the equation of the line that's parallel to the given line, passing through the point of negative three comma five, would be y equals negative two x. And then instead of writing plus negative one, it's more common to just write minus one. So again, this is the equation of the line that's parallel to the given line and passes through the point negative three comma five. To verify our answer, we could graph the given equation y equals eight minus two x, plot the point negative three comma five. Then we can graph the line given by the equation that we just found to make sure it passes through the given point and is parallel to the given line. Let's go ahead and take a look at this. This blue line is a graph of the given equation. The point negative three comma five is plotted here in red, and the equation we found produces this red line. And notice how this red line is parallel to the blue line, and it also passes through the given point, verifying our equation is correct. I hope you found this helpful.